so we are given two series the second series is convergent and um, we need to determine whether the following statement is true that that since the uh, uh, terms of the first series is are less smaller than terms of the second series which is convergent that means that the first series is also convergent well uh, here uh, here we need to talk about the direct comparison test. The direct comparison test states that if 0 is less than a n, which is less or equals to b n for all n, this is super important for all n, then we know that if the series of b n converges, then a n also converges. If a n diverges, then b n also diverges. So here we can use the direct comparison test. However, the only problem is that we can only see the first four terms of each series. So we cannot really make a conclusion that all terms of the first series are smaller than the corresponding terms of the second series. However, we let a n be the nth term of the first series and b n be the nth term of the second series. Then we get that a n equals 1 over 999 plus n while bn equals 1 over n squared here now when we have a general a general form of a n we understand that a n is always less than bn because 1 over 999 plus n is less than 1 over n squared so that means that n squared minus n minus 999 is less than 0. If we solve this, we get that n minus 32.11 times n plus 31.11 is less than 0. So that means that this expression is larger than 0 for all n greater or equal to 33. So that means that 0 is less than a n and a n is less than b n for n which are smaller or equal to 32. And a n is larger than b n for n greater or equal to 33. So we got that these two sequences do not satisfy the direct comparison test uh, because um, um, because uh, this uh, this condition is not true for all n, so that means that the statement is false. Statement is false because direct comparison test is not satisfied.